There are five foundation workouts that should be in every exercise program for every person on the planet. If you're not on one, if you're not doing these five exercises, you might want to reconsider your plan. We'll discuss them in this video. Are you doing them? If you enjoy the content on this channel, click the subscribe button, click the notification bell so that you'll be down every time we drop a new life gains video. And let's talk about the fab five of fitness. What's good, YouTube and returning life gainers? All knowing, all loving, all feeling, all seeing, all powerful. Just damn all everything. The sexy as hell host. And we're talking about the Fab Five fundamental exercises everyone on the planet should be doing. And before we do that, let me put on my brand new plus seven glasses of sexy as hell. Work on skilling up this craft a little bit. Giving you guys a more informed review. And if you like these glasses, Click the video description link to Fermio.com. You can get yourself a pair, prescription or non-prescription. Best deal going on on the web I've found so far on glasses. Those five exercises are simple. Number one is a squat. And I'm not talking about the hat squat. I'm talking about a front squat or barbell squat with the bar on your back. Get in the hole and do it. Those are the biggest muscles in your body, your legs, ladies and gentlemen. Squatting is what builds pretty much every muscle in the lower extremity. It even builds your core because you have to hold your core to stabilize all that weight. If that's not in your program, it needs to be. And it's hard. And I know you don't like doing them. Some days my mind won't allow me to want to do them, but I still have to get in there and do it. That is the foundation for your leg training. You've got to have it. The next one, deadlifts. Needs to be in your program. That works the last. Think of deadlifts almost as like a vertical leg press, but it includes traps. It includes your lower back. It includes your legs. It includes your calves. It includes everything. You've got to have deadlifts into your program. And these are all exercises that everybody needs because these are motions that we do every day. We're sitting, we're standing, and deadlifts and squats work those motions. That's when bench press. I don't care which bitch press you do. I don't care if it's incline press, decline press, flat bench. Keep in mind, pretty much all of these are compound movements. Compound movements mean you're getting multiple joints, more calories burned, more work done. And the bench press compound movement works pretty much everything. You need to have that in your program. Make sure that's in there. The next one, standing shoulder press. Works the every area of the shoulder. Works your tricep. And when done properly, coming from the chest, going to the overhead position, and you move your head forward, it's going to get every single area of your shoulder, ensuring that you build those shoulders, and that needs to be in your program as well. Last one that's kind of hard for some people, but you can modify it, is a pull-up. You know, weighted pull-ups are a great exercise to have in your program, but if you can't do a pull-up, then do the modified pull-ups. And the modified pull-ups work the upper back as well. And these are the foundations of a good training program. There are numerous fitness programs written around just these five exercises because they work. They're time-tested. Every fitness person I know, bodybuilding, sports, use these exercises and a few more to build a nice physique, be athletic and to be strong. A lot of the old school guys that I work out with are doing these exercises and I work out with some guys that are past their 50s still doing these things and they look great. They look better than a whole lot of young people. And these are the staples that all of them have told me they keep into their workout. So ladies and gentlemen, if this is not in your program, you need to find a way to work it in there. Yes, the isolation movements work for a specific purpose, but if you want to get overall growth and development, add these five into your workout. And if you don't have a good workout plan and you don't have a coach to help you out getting these things, take it from me. I'm here to help you. Go to www.facebook.com forward slash lifegains07. Hit me up if you want to do some training with me. I do online coaching. If you're in the triad area of North Carolina, I do one-on-one -on -one coaching. 
pretty affordable rates and I'm here to help you guys and I want to be that accountability buddy so that I can see people make the transformation I made. I went from 350 down to 197 and I did it with these exercises as my foundation and they should be in your foundation as well. That's going to do it for this video. Don't forget to like my video, comment and subscribe. Go out there and get yourself a life game. You looking for that coach to help you out? Hit me up. Whether you want the online help or whether you're local and you want to get some help one-on-one -on -one right here in the triad, I'm here to help you. And until that next sexy as hell video, I'll see you.